How do aliens check into hotels on Earth? The male lead walked up to the vending machine. A lightning bolt shot from his head, and the machine spit out coins. He threw a pile of coins onto the table, astonishing the hotel owner. The pointed-headed male lead picked up a bar of soap, sniffed it, and started eating it hungrily, mistaking the toilet paper for noodles. He ate a big roll in one go. It turned out they were pointed-headed aliens, whose spaceship crashed on Earth. The two of them floated to the surface of the water, and then came to the hotel. The wife was not used to the hotel mattress. She shivered all over. The aliens wouldn't be picked up for another 18 years, and the wife happened to be pregnant. So the two of them had to work on Earth. The man became an electrician, and the woman became a cleaner. They lived in a tin shack, and when they were thirsty, they drank dishwashing liquid. They even learned it to smoke 20 cigarettes at once. But they worked very hard, and the boss even gave them fake IDS. In the car, the pointed-headed man started chewing gum and blew bubbles. The boss was so disgusted that he refused it. To better adapt to human life, the male lead went to the dentist to have his teeth pulled. The dentist carefully examined his teeth. His complicated expression hard to express. The male lead continued to open his mouth wide and revealed three rows of teeth. At night, the two of them stood sleeping like that. At this time, officials from the immigration office came knocking. The wife was scared and hurriedly woke the man up, and the two of them quickly broke the window and fled. They moved to another city, and the man became a taxi driver, while the wife took out the money she had saved over the years to buy a new house. Just when the two of them were looking forward to it. Suddenly, the wife's water broke, and it gushed out like a flood, almost flooding the house. The woman was quickly taken to the obstetrics and gynecology department, but the alien baby turned out to be as strong as a cow. The mother danced on the spot, and the husband could only hold her down from her. After several days of effort, with a roar from the woman, they gave birth to a little pointed-headed baby. The doctors were all excited and crying. The two couples gradually integrated into Earth life. They raised their baby together, celebrated Christmas together, and played by the seaside together. They sent their daughter to training classes, and days passed by like this. The pointed-headed baby grew up into a pointed-headed beauty. The little girl even fell in love with a chubby boy, just as they were having a home date. Officials from the immigration office arrived in a police car. The pointed-headed aliens drove away in their car, and a flying saucer appeared in the sky, lifting the car and saving the pointed-headed family. The pointed-headed girl and her chubby boyfriend also parted ways. They returned to their home planet, and the male lead reported on his life on Earth to the king. After hearing this, the king was furious and decided to punish the traitor. So he threw him into the arena to perform. The male lead was trembling while waiting in the wings, and the monster entered the stage fiercely. The male lead was scared to the point of being incontinent, but then he thought of the golf he had learned it on Earth. He hit the rocks on the ground into the monster's mouth and defeated the monster. The audience cheered, and the male lead became the champion of the event. The king ordered the male lead to lead the attack on Earth, and they set off in a spaceship. The male lead liked life on Earth very much, so he detonated the spaceship halfway there and secretly returned to Earth with his family. Family, starting their happy life all over again.